Hello there, kids, and it's I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, and we left off, we were, well, we were still in the Brotherhood of Steel. Uh, turns out, um, well, <laughs> I was wrong. We were not done, because the quest still has it listed as trying to ignore the Brotherhood. That's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to get them crossed off the list and say, hey, we know them, they're no longer going to be a threat or a problem. So, we're gonna have Greetings, to do. my friend. I hope I can be of some assistance I to you. I guess is talk more to uh, McNamara, except there's nothing else going on. It's a protective measure that was enacted what? after our defeat at Helios. The NCR was hot on our heels, and we wouldn't have survived another encounter. It was decided that we would stay quiet for a time, heal the wounded, and try to come up with a new strategy. Okay. However, after we had fully recuperated, our first scouting measures showed that the NCR's presence in this region had only increased in our absence. There are now more than five times the number of NCR troops in the area as when we fought them. And we have half the number we did at Helios. And so the lockdown has been extended. To go outside would be the death of us all. But I thought we talked about this. The, with a kinda are spread thin. They're dealing with so many different things right now. I thought. All right. I thought what we talked about What did you wish to this. speak about? So there's nothing else I can talk to him about. Bye. So I'm I'm forced into ignoring them. Is that what it is? I'm just forced into ignoring them. All right. I guess that's my only option. All right. Well, if someone else is able to find out what I'm supposed to be doing, let me know. Because right now, I have no idea. There's Looks nothing like else that... Out of the picture. One less thing for us to deal with. Yeah, for you specifically, yeah. Me, however, that just means I have to deal with a whole lot more. But that's none of your concern. You guys will stay out here. Until I force everyone out. Alright. Out we go. I don't think we're going to run into a problem on our way out, are we? I don't think so. I don't think that there's a thing we're going to run into. If there is, well then, fuck me. But I mean... Nope. Nothing. We did the thing. Whoa, that was a weird flicker. Oh, that's what it was. It was a bark scorpion that hasn't been looted yet? Okay. Anyway, now that we've done all of this, done all the things that I should have done, I guess we're going to have to tell Yes Man we're familiar with the Brotherhood and that we can ignore them. Because that's the only option I have. There's no other options I can use. I guess that's it. Yeah, nothing coming behind us. I was drinking my coffee, so I figured I might as well check, because there is always a threat in that direction from a respawning freeside thugs. But wasn't this time. Was not this time. So let's go back into the Lucky 38. And uh, we'll talk to Yes Man. Then we'll continue on with the next phase of the mission. Because, uh, well, nothing else to do. At this point, we've almost completed the game. How about that? <laughs> That's not a thing I expected to be saying. A 200 and, uh, 140 almost parts in. It's 39. We might be able to finish it by 250. <laughs> Who'd have thunk it? I didn't. Alright. It's a penthouse. I was supposed to go to the penthouse. Presidential suite's mine. I keep forgetting these things. Although I have collected quite a menagerie of companions up in the presidential suite, let me tell you. I went the wrong way. I'm a dumb. Whee! Hey there! Oh! Hi again! Hi there! Can I help you with something else? 
I think we're going to talk about... Please, go on. Maybe moving on to the next, uh, next phase. I want them left alone. Okay. Consider them forgotten. Along with the projections that predict they'll be our biggest enemy. Forgotten. That accounts for all the tribes you need okay, to... Okay, if you say so. You did a super job wrapping I'm part up, of them, though, so they're, they're not going to pull that. I have to. Uh-huh. There's some big news. Oh, I really? I coded a military radio transmission, and it turns out the NCR president, Aaron Kimball, is going to visit Hoover Dam. Is he? I guess he wants to boost the troops' morale. But according to projections Mr. House made, he has an 83.75% chance of being assassinated. Oops. Yeah, they didn't account anyway, for that, did they? It looks like Mr. House thought it was important to keep President Kimball alive. Is it? Why did they want him alive? Mr. House ran projections on how the NCR rather? public will react to a defeat at Hoover Dam. Overwhelmingly, they'll blame Kimball. Oh. But if Kimball dies at Hoover Dam, there's no obvious scapegoat for them to blame, so they'll blame New Vegas instead. I see. So that means reduced tourism for up to five years. The equations are pretty complicated. Mr. House sure liked numbers. I'm sure he did. Honestly, that makes sense, though. Because when things go wrong, they're going to blame the leader who led them to it going wrong, rather than the place that it went wrong. Or rather, the reasons why it went wrong. That is, that is true and ingenious that he came up with that. Some people would have, uh, some people would have just let that happen. And you know what? There is, there is good thoughts put in there. I'm on good terms with the NCR as well. They'll help, they'll let me help protect them. Great. A ranger named Graham has been placed in charge of security for the Grant, president's Grant, I think visit. you meant... You'll want to talk to him. Once okay. Once the president is safe, there's one more thing for you to take care of. Uh-huh. This gadget I'm handing you is called an override module. Really? Mr. House had two of these made years and years ago. Just like him to think ahead. I'm sure take it is. Take the module to the El Dorado substation and attach it to the power control terminal. I'll handle the rest. Hmm. What will the override module let you do? I'll use the substation to send... A huge jolt of electricity to the Lucky 38. Turns out this casino has its own reactor. All it needs is a jump start. Huh. With the reactor running at full tilt, I can boost the transmission strength of the Lucky 38's command and control network. That is useful. I'm talking direct tactical control of hundreds of upgraded Securitrons at vast distances. You know that's going to come in handy. Fuck yeah it is. God damn, that's great. That is, that is ingenious. Fucking Mr. House thought of everything. Fucking hell yeah. Kind of sad I killed him. <laughs> yeah, kind of not, because he was a bit of an egolomaniac. It's, egolomaniac is not right. Uh, I was thinking megalomaniac. Although that one's probably more apt. Uh, anyway. <laughs> not like I'm. Not like me, no, no, not at all. I'm just a regular maniac. <laughs> Anywho, I'll get it done. Great. When this is taken care of, we'll be all set for the Legion to make its move. All right. Sounds good to me. Perfect. NCR infamy gained. Uh-oh. Well, I tread on the bear. Oopsie doodle. Oopsie doopsie doodle. And for the Republic, part two failed. Oh no. Oh no. Was there. What, what was... When did I even hit that exactly? I don't remember that. Um, for the Republic, part two. Oh. I would have had to Hoover Dam at this point anyway. Alright. So this was. This was. Proper way for it to go. All right, so this is optional. It isn't required, but it's optional. I'm gonna do it, but go to the Eldorado substation and install the override chip. Report to Ranger Grant. All right. Alrighty. Uh, let's 
go to the presidential suite, because I'm pretty sure that's where I left Raul and uh, Eddie. Pretty sure. Yep, sounds like it. Hey! Uh, follow me. Right behind you, boss. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, it's fucking... It's so nice to have fucking Raul with me. Fucking Danny Trejo. Oh, it's the best. It's the best ever, man. Danny Trejo. Man, oh man, who'd have thunk it? Uh, did What's I, up? What's up? Did I give you anything good? What do you think I should do about Eddie? Brotherhood or followers? This shouldn't be too surprising, but I'd prefer you let the followers examine him. Uh-huh. Hopefully the reasons are obvious. That's... Why not the Brotherhood? The Brotherhood hoards knowledge and is obviously a smidge more violent than the followers. True. Don't get me wrong, I'd rather the Brotherhood get the intel than see it lost somewhere in the desert, but I'd prefer the followers overall. That's fair. That's fair. What's up? I'll, I'll, I'll give that to uh, the followers then. Um, tell me about yourself. I'm really very boring. You'd get better stories out of a freeside junkie. I'm asking you because I'm interested. Don't put yourself down. Oh, all right. I'm 30-ish. Well, late 30s. Okay. I was born west of here. Mm -hmm. I was an only child and spent most of my time with my mother. My father died when I was young and I never got over it. Oh, and I like medicine and reading books about failed pre-war socioeconomic policies. Right now, I'm sure and you're asking too. yourself, why hasn't some lucky man scooped this bachelor off his feet? Like I said, I'm boring. Why don't you like talking about yourself? Also, um, I'm surprised, yeah, no one scooped you off your feet yet. Just like hoarded you to themselves, because you actually seem pretty cool. Uh, why don't you like talking about yourself? Some people do. I just don't. Look, That's fair. I appreciate that you're trying to be friendly, but I'd just rather not discuss it. Alright. Alright. Uh, let me see if I can check yeah i knew it i knew it um i don't know if i'd be able to pull this off though um uh, yep that's what i thought well did i manage to get it at least it's my stuff oh man wait did i i didn't actually see it ah oh, man i didn't what's up ah uh, yeah. You have quite the menagerie at your disposal. You're not wrong. If you can get the posse down to small gang size, I'll happily go with you. Small gang. Okay. Ah. Uh. uh. Angry soldier robots with bazookas. I'm sure they'll be a good police force. <laughs> You're not wrong, Raul. You're not wrong at all. Let's be honest. Uh, I, th I think you need good to wait here. Good call. I mean, if that's what you really want boss okay um we'll meet up at the lucky 38 hey as long as you're not asking me to go back to black mountain i'm a happy old man <laughs> oh man i didn't i didn't want What's to up? i just need to get the weapons off of there's something about that robot that doesn't seem all right to me i'm not saying we shouldn't take it with us i'm just saying that if it were to fall into lake mead and be irreparably damaged and if you threw an EMP grenade in after it, well, there are worse things happening in the world, right? What is it with you and Eddie? Man, what sure. is it? Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin, okay? I wasn't planning on it, but, I mean, you keep making... You keep making jokes about Eddie. Uh, I'm starting to wonder. I'm starting to wonder if I shouldn't. Like, Eddie's good. Eddie has good uses. Eddie's a good boy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Okay. Let's uh just get some water in us, shall we? There we go. Here comes everything else, huh? Oh, food is definitely. Food, food is definitely next on the list. Ah, uh, hmm, hmm, <laughs> ah. Uh, Egg one on a stick. That'll work. Sure. Alright, cool. Um, don't need to maintain that. Don't need to maintain that. Don't need to maintain that. Okay, we're good. How about this? Nope. Nope. 
Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Oh, do need to maintain that a little. Huh. I could just let Eddie take care of that. In fact, I will. Eddie! Eddie! Need you to do a thing for me. Uh, can you repair my weapon? Thank you. And also, let's make some satchel charges. Uh, there we go. Cool. Beautiful. Alright. Oh, there's Raul. There you are, buddy. Oh, it's you. Yeah. You need something repaired or something? Yeah. Uh, do you want to take along? Sorry, boss. But as much as I like to risk getting killed by your side, you seem to already have some help. He, he... <laughs> Come, Rahul, adventure Sorry, awaits. Sorry, boss. Okay. All sure, right. boss. What do you want to know? Uh, I wanted to bring him along. That's all I wanted to know. Anything we'll talk more say, later. Boss. All righty. Uh, let's, uh... What's up? Have Arcade run along now. Oh, I thought my charm could win you over, but I guess it wasn't meant to be. You sure you want me to go? Uh, on second thought, stick around. I need to get some of this off of you. Sure. Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin, okay? I forgot you're equipped with eyeglasses. There we go. Uh, now we go. I'll head back to the old... Oh, no, 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 no. fuck. Well, I'm going to be heading by there anyway. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm I am so oh, overburdened. Anything's better than staying here. Let's go. Alrighty, sounds good. I'm sure you'll be... Hey, the whole gang's here. Whoops, that was not what I wanted. Recruited all companions. I didn't realize I hadn't gotten there yet. Hey, I did the thing. All right. Give you that. Give you lucky. There we go. Let's give you the good armor. Give you that. Give you that. There we go. Look at you. You're dressed up all good. Man, you look good. All right. Let's get moving, huh? Get out of here onto the casino floor. And let's go to the old Mormon fort. Because, uh, well, gonna drop off Eddie, maybe? Or just give him, give them the info from Eddie, I think. That's what we want to do. So, we're gonna follow uh, Arcade's advice there. Alright. Wait, am I supposed to have Arcade with me? For that mission? Fuck, I don't know. Damn it, I don't know. Uh, it's not really a mission per se either, so I mean. Ah, oh, man. If that's the case, well. Mm. We'll find out. We'll find out. And let's switch to. Yeah, let's just switch to the pistol. There we go. While I'm running around free side. Might as well. Eh. There we go. I'll need to double check, though, on that mission. I just want to make it to the fort first. But, uh, yeah, I'll have to double check on... Again, I keep calling it a mission. It's not a mission. It's not a mission, but it is something. What the... Who are you? You made House must have had special plans for you to get into the Lucky 38 and come out alive. Well, that's fair. I must have made a mess of the Omertas too. I guess. Uh, anyway. Here we are. Oh, there's Arcade. Okay. So, at least we know where he is. 
are you doing? Oh, you're a gambler. Okay. Why are you in here? <laughs> okay. Well, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm going to double check on if we need arcade for that. And uh, if that's the case, then I'll pal around with arcade for a little bit. <laughs> I was making sure I said that sentence right. Pal around with arcade. Okay. Yeah, it's my brain. <laughs> it's been a weird couple days. Also, we're almost near the end of the game, so my brain is like, hey, almost done. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games. And, well... Finally kicking off the last little bits of the main mission and uh, just tying up loose ends with the companions because I figure, why not for you? <laughs>